Flooding is also taking a toll on areas in western South Dakota. According to a recent post from the Oglala Sioux Tribe Emergency Management Facebook page, the melting is causing water levels to rise fast. It also says people who live in flood areas should keep watch on water levels and evacuate to exits to start to become unusable. Now, Kelloland Sarah McDonald gives you a firsthand look. People are dealing with on the Pine Ridge Reservation. Homes are surrounded by water and roads are becoming blocked. That type of flooding in all nine districts um, in our reservation. Our creeks are swelling up into being rapid rivers. We have a lot of fast snowbound that's coming off of the ridges and the hills and it's going into the creeks, but we also have a lot of water, water coming from Nebraska. And that's not all. South Dakota House Representative Perry Poyer says some people have been evacuated from their homes. Speaking with the emergency management services here in Pine Ridge, um, they're, they really want the professionals to help evacuating people, people who are really trained in swift water uh, rescue um, because it's dangerous. Poyer says they are thankful for any help they can get. We have a lot of volunteers that are coming from the different communities. So communi some volunteers within our communities are helping in their respective communities. Uh, we're getting an overflow of support and we, we love that and we thank you. And it's a very positive feeling to know that there's people out there who want to help. For Kelloland News, I'm Sarah McDonald. Fourier says officials are currently working on coordinating volunteer efforts for people who want to help. They are working on a website with that information, plus they're working on getting flood food and supply boxes ready to send out to communities.